Hello, this is Garth. I'm providing some commentaries for uh, my friend Rexamin. I beg your pardon, English is not my uh, native language. So, uh, Red decided to develop the night in a strange, funny way. Uh, I went for a fianchetto, and Blue went for uh, pushing his depot. Nothing really happens in this uh, initial uh, phase of the game. Blue pushing his pawn. Some diagonals are opened. I'm preparing to double fianchetto. And uh, red is threatening uh, a quite annoying check on blue. Blue didn't prevent it. I set up my bishop for uh, the eventual uh, red check. And uh, he went for it. Now blue uh, could have played the uh, Pawn to c6 uh, to avoid uh, losing material, but he preferred to block the, the check with uh, with his bishop, if I remember right. Allowing me to take uh, the rook on a4. Green is trying to profit of the situation, pushing his, uh, his pawn. I took the rook, and blue keep pushing his, uh, his pawn, uh, ignoring the my bishop, basically. So I retreat it. Red didn't want to exchange bishop. So he retreated his, his bishop as well, and it's a good move. So far, nothing really happens. Another good move by red, preventing the trade of uh, dark the square bishop all green uh, obtained was to open my 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 file for uh, for the rook with this trade and now he's trying to to exchange my light square bishop here at maybe lost a time uh, that night move wasn't really necessary I didn't want to trade my bishop so I check green and the pair for his bishop as well so red is trying to to profit thinking I would trade my bishop so he could push his pawn capturing the knight, but of course I I won't uh, I won't trade. Uh, and so he lost a pawn. Uh, I'm not sure about this uh, exchange sacrifice. Uh, it's just good for me because uh, now green had to recapture and I can take uh, his uh, his rook on n4. Uh, 
I, I had uh, quite uh, quite a good game here. And nothing, nobody is attacking. Blue gets uh, another queen, and uh, red uh, should try to castle queenside, in my opinion. I'm not sure. This is a good move. Queen to j4 by red. Uh, there's a little pressure on h13, so uh, I develop a develop a knight to to cover it, preparing castle as well. So far, uh, I was very lucky. Managing to capture uh, two rooks without uh, compromising myself. So, red uh, castle long, uh, it's, not, uh, it's not a bad move. Blue just blundered the knight, and uh, I was thinking about not capturing because I'm not really developed, but uh, it's a freebie, so who can resist to a free knight? And uh, I was lucky because Green uh, uh, didn't try to profit of uh, of my capture, but instead uh, wanted to to attack Red. And I don't like this move by Red because uh, now Green can exchange queens, and uh, it's not so so good for both players. Okay, blue is attacking my bishop. I'm gonna retreat it. Green. I want to trade, of course, so pushes his pawn and uh, another good move by red, defending his knight. And now blue checks green. And here I was uh, wondering about uh, bishop to m10 to take uh, the green rook, but uh, since I am not uh, developed, I prefer to, to castle and uh, not taking any risks. So now green uh, all his kings. So did red. <laughs> Good move, solid move. And green is going for infiltration on, uh, uh, and blue is going for infiltration on, uh, on green camp. 
I just start to push my pawns. And this queen move by red, I'm not sure uh, what uh, what it does. Blue is going for another queen, pushing his pawn. I push my pawn as well. And green uh, is trying to survive, basically. Good move by red. His pawn on j2 can be captured, because otherwise uh, blue will capture green queen. Here uh, I would play queen to k1 instead of j1, uh, seems more active, but it's okay. And blue is gonna gonna get another queen, and uh, and he was doing great. And here I was thinking about uh, uh, I was thinking about uh, B10, how to mate blue uh, without uh, not uh, him to notice. <laughs> uh, so basically, I was trying to to get my queen on the 10th row. And here uh, it's a bad move by green, uh, forcing basically that's uh, the exchange of bishops. Uh, he, he really didn't need it. Blue promotes. Bishop uh, are exchanged. And red uh, start to push his pawn. To annoying green, not a bad plan. This king is pretty safe. Blue is wandering around with his queens, not really threatening anything, maybe something on, uh, on green. And here I uh, I came up with, uh, with a plan to put my queen on uh, e10, then push my h-pawn and uh, mate, uh, mate blue. That seems easy to mate green, <laughs> while red is trying to profit of the situation. This rook move by by blue doesn't make any sense to me. I I put the rook on uh, the semi-open file to push my pawn uh, even further in a not so distant future. Here green uh, blunders uh, the knight basically, and red uh, is trying to exchange his bishop for uh, the green one and uh, I'm not sure it's a good move this one maybe it is why not trying to get some points cannibalizing green 
And here I'm, I'm proceeding with my evil plan to mate blue without him noticing. So red take the bishop, and uh, it was indeed a good move because uh, green can recapture, otherwise he will lose his queen. But blue checks green as well, not defending uh, his red bishop, so green can uh, capture. But after the red move, green didn't uh, blue didn't notice I was meeting him. And after uh, this push, that it's pretty good, I was able to mate blue. With a bit of lag. And so... Uh, now basically green is busted and uh, it's uh, it's around for uh, for giving in mate i profit for uh, the red check taking uh, the pawn of green Rook K, K1, good move by red, bringing another piece into the attack. Another good plan by red could be to just ignore green and push his pawns to, to make queens because uh, green is basically busted and uh, maybe he's uh, in. Is uh, in his interest to keep it keep uh, him alive. Uh, for instance, this move by by red knight h5 doesn't accomplish anything. Uh, it's a waste of time. I start pushing my pawns. Wanna get a new queen? I'm threatening. Uh, Green rook 2, red uh, keeps moving his knight, not really accomplishing anything, my queen, green uh, doesn't defend his rook anymore, so I can capture it. And uh, red, uh, luckily for me, has no mate. So he decided to check, but uh, I'm able to mate green with this check. So basically, red uh, giving me the mate to green. And that's it. I hope uh, it wasn't too painful, my comments. And uh, cheers.